Hello, welcome to my channel. Uh, this is my Husky uh, air compressor, and I bought this when it was on sale and, uh, from Home Depot. I believe it's only like $99. So this is a uh, eight gallon, uh, 150 psi, uh, 4.8 scfm, which is stand for standard cubic feet per minute, uh, at four psi and three point. Seven. This has been, been very useful uh, a compressor for me because uh, I use this to uh, inflate my car tire. So this is very useful, and uh, so this is nice to have uh, for you know inflating your car tire or the basketball. Or uh, I have electric bike now, so I can use that to inflate my electric bike. So. This way you don't have to run to the uh, gas station to get air from there because right now they charge a lot uh, at the gas station to get like uh, uh, for two two minutes uh, of getting air over there and they charge about 75 cents to a dollar so why not buy this one? This is very useful and uh, it, it lasts you a long time right here. You got the two wheel right there you can wheel it around anywhere and you got the tank right here that can hold and uh, let me show you how to charge this up right here. So all you need to do is just plug it in and just turn it on. All right, up to after it goes to uh, 100 psi, it's shut off. So this is how you put air in the uh, tire. Let's see if your tire go a little flat. You can use this compressor to uh, to pump up your car tire. You need this part right here. You can buy this from Home Depot about uh, 19 bucks right here. Not very expensive at all. And uh, yeah. So you just push this bag right here. Push that bag and then push this in. And, uh, and just release it to lock it. And then right here. All right, just remove the stem cover right here. Remove this little piece and then just push this in and then squeeze this right here. And squeeze it. You see it tell you how many, uh, it's right here. It tell you how many PSI right there. For this car, we want around 36 PSI, see? Just push that. Right there. That's it. It's easy to do. And yeah, for bicycle, you need to change to this uh, yellow tube. So just take this out. Do the same thing. So this is how to inflate your bicycle right here. And then just push this in. Right there. See, there's a red, the red lever right here. Push it down, and it force the air in there. So that's how you do it. So it's very easy to use this compressor to uh, inflate your bicycle tire or your car tire, it's, and. It saves you a lot of money in the long run because uh, if you keep running to the uh, gas station, they charge you about a 75 cent to a dollar to uh, to inflate your tire. So after you finish, this is uh, pull this ring right here. You don't want any air in the in the, in the tank, so you want to release all the air to uh, to make. Uh, Until go all the way down to uh, zero psi. So this is this is a little tip that my uh, friend Dave told me. So you want to keep your compressor, you know, uh, last for a long time. This is what you need to do. Uh, after you finish using it, just make sure you uh, you uh, let all the air out of the tank, all the way to zero. This way, your compressor will last longer. So thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Bye-bye.